I didn't think that the Republicans could find anyone who was more out of touch with the middle class than Mitt Romney, but they did. They found Chris Christie. Barbara Buono was in the backyard of Democratic Assemblyman Ralph Caputo in Nutley, the town she grew up in, to draw attention to her economic plan. You grow an economy by focusing on the middle class, she said, and by investing more in high school and college students. They may get straight A's while they're in college, but they graduate with three D's, a degree, debt, and disappointment. And the disappointment is that there's no jobs to pay off those loans when they graduate. Bono's 40-point plan would hike the minimum wage, redirect tax credits away from large corporations and toward small businesses, require all employers to provide paid sick days for their workers, and foster research partnerships between universities and corporations. The Roche Corporation is leaving Nutley, she maintained, for lack of such a partner in New Jersey. You know, Roche went to San Francisco and the Lower East Side of Manhattan, Massachusetts. All those states have in common are strong research partnerships between colleges and university and these emerging markets. And how do they do that? They create partnerships. I had a piece of legislation in over a year ago. The governor vetoed it and called it along with a, pile, with a, a bunch of other bills that would have stimulated the economy. He called it a pile of crap. Quote, unquote. She said high-tech jobs are averaging $86,000 a year, while Christie just oversees creation of lower-wage jobs. You know, we can't put our heads in the sand in New Jersey and say, well, you know, it's a New Jersey comeback when, when we know that, you know, uh, unemployment, which is the highest in, highest in the region and one of the highest in the country, isn't a comeback, it's a catastrophe. And we can't be in denial about our problems. We have to address them. You can't just say, oh, well, you know, we're cutting a, a ribbon on the boardwalk and everything's, you know, all, all hunky-dory. Christie was asked today about the Buono plan. In my quick glance over it, um, it's a return to the Corzine years when she was in charge before. Higher taxes, higher spending, bigger government. I know what these guys are doing. I know what Christie and Duhame and Palatucci are doing. They're trying, they're, they're going, you know, in their own little, the, the Republican talking points. They're trying to dredge up the remains of a very unpopular Democratic governor because that's the only Democrat this guy's ever going to be. I think she was tremendous, um, you know, and I think the more people see her, interact with her, they like her. The crowd here wasn't large in Assemblyman Caputo's backyard, but what this event lacked in people it made up for in passion, as Barbara Buono's quest to unseat a hugely popular governor grinds on. For NJ Today, I'm Michael Aaron in Nutley.